Welcome to Players Only Halftime Re Report for Cinema <laughs> American Express. It's me, the big Dan Rather, Zeke, and Go ahead, Brian Mumbles. <laughs> Fart it out. Versus the American Express teammates. <laughs> <laughs> you see James Harden having a nice game, Eric Gordon, Chris Paul, Houston's big three playing very well. Speaking of James Harden, BD. I mean, I love him. You know, uh, when you see a 6'5 guard that plays the point, can get to the basket, you know, you can't really guard him with a single defender. Uh, the way he gets to the basket and finishes with both hands, but he just lulls you to sleep. So anytime you got an ISO situation for James Harden, it's just the defense is at his mercy. Hot tamale, look at that man. He got a beard. We got something in common. Zeke, I've been knowing you for a long time. Love your knowledge of the game. Love picking your brain. I love to hear you talk about other great point guards. Tell me what you saw on CB3 tonight. Well, what I see happening with, with Chris Paul, he's definitely in this system, he's extended his career. And I think he's got a chance to play until he's 40 playing this way. You see, he, he got the mid-range, the in and out with the snake dribble. Okay, and then he loves you to sleep. And his three-point game now has definitely improved since being in Houston. D'Antoni has him extremely confident with the three ball. He's got the mid-range. He's still an excellent passer. And, you know, with this system, the way Houston plays, the way D'Antoni has him playing. Absolutely. He can play this way for a very long time and be extremely effective. I'm looking at the Portland team. Damian Lillard, before the All-Star break, was feeling a little bit underappreciated. Mm -hmm. Ever since he made the All-Star team, he stepped his game up a little bit. But Portland, I'm very impressed. They're in third place right now, but if they want to go far, they're definitely going to need help from the others. And you know, right now, Damian Lillard is doing a good job looking for his guys. Farouk. Aminu right there. Aminu. Far Farouk, that's his name? Farouk. Farouk Aminu is playing very well. Had a big first half. But the others in Portland, if Portland wants to go maybe to the second round, I don't know about the third round, because that, you know, round's going to be, uh, belong to yeah. Houston and Golden yeah. State. But if they want to at least get out the first round, the others is definitely going to have to step up for the Portland Trails players. But, but as you can see, Shaq, like Portland, whether they play Golden State or Houston, they're good enough to take either one of these teams into a deep series, you know, six to seven games. So. Yeah, you, yeah you, I mean, you want to you get out that eighth spot. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you want to yeah. get out that seven eighth spot. Right. You know, you want to be somewhere, you know, six and five. But I think for Portland, they, they have an opportunity to get to the second round because they got the guard play. Mm -hmm. And then when you look at somebody like Nurkic and the difference he makes in the middle, I think they, they could be a problem for any team in, uh, in the playoffs. But you definitely don't want to be playing Golden State. Uh, I agree with both of you. Back with more in a minute on the Amex Halftime Report. It is I, the Big Dan Rather. <laughs> the Big Dan Rather. <laughs> Uh, you be coming up with more the, the, names. The big sorbet. I didn't mess up. <laughs> what had happened was the fly. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>